Hector Hernandez. Most people know me as Tito. Uh, you see me, call me Tito. Don't call me Hector. No, I'm 34 years old. <laughs> I'll be 35 this year, and I've been a member of OCF for four years. My name is Kelly Everwine, and I'm 30 years old, and I've been at OCF for coming up to my five year anniversary in December. My name is Michelle, and I've been at OCF for about four and a half years. My name is Jose Gonzalez. I've been at OCF for at least four years now, and I'm 37 years old. My name is Archie La Verena. Uh, my age is 35, and I've been at OCF for five years now. My name is Allison Donlin, I'm 52, and I've been here about four or five years. My name is Judy Tubert, I'm 27 years old, and I have been attending O'Hare CrossFit for the past four years. My name is Eliza Buckner, I am 46, and I've been a member for four years. Uh, my name is Matt Tierney, uh, I am 31, going to be 32 in a couple months, and I've been at OCF for a little over four and a half years, almost since it started. Uh, I found O'Hare CrossFit through a friend of my boyfriend's who was attending here, and he absolutely loved it, and so I thought that I would give it a try. A trainer that I was training with over at Valley's um, was leaving and recommended I come over here and try it, and it was immediately a place I wanted to be a part of. Well, how I found OCF is a little, it's, it's kind of a funny story because um, I was trying to find something different, you know, I had an export um, pass, you know, I was going to export and I found myself, you know, not um, enjoying it as much. So, you know, I, I heard about CrossFit, and so I started, you know, trying to Google, you know, CrossFits around in the area and things like that, and um, I couldn't find anything. So then um, I just, I went on the maps on my phone and I just typed in CrossFit and O'Hare CrossFit popped up. And um, I just drove over here. I interrupted Ange in one of the middle of his workouts. He gave me the stink eye, but he told me to come back the next day. I came back the next day, and uh, I'm, I'm, I'm glad I interrupted his workout. So in 2011, um, Mike Olson is actually my brother-in-law, which means you know my wife, Lizzie, and his wife, Rhonda, are sisters. So at the time, Lizzie, Rhonda, and Mike were uh, dedicated members of the gym. and. Um, they convinced me to come, and the rest is history. So I actually found CrossFit through another member, Maria Pichos. Um, I was going through a transition, transitionary period in my life where I just graduated grad school, um, but while I was in grad school and doing my undergrad, I was also personal training part-time, and the gym I was at closed. And after I graduated grad school, I just needed to focus on moving into my career. Um, so I stopped personal training and decided to focus more on my career um, and my you know, career goals of being a dietitian and working in corporate wellness, which is what I'm doing now. So um, one of my old, my old client, Marie, actually started doing CrossFit here and she was telling me about it one day. And I said, all right, hey, that sounds like a great idea and it sounds challenging and different. And um, I kind of just wanted to show up and do a workout. I didn't want to have to really think about it. I went through so many years of training people and coaching them. I really just wanted to be trained myself and I wanted to be pushed. So um, that's kind of what brought me here. I found OCF randomly online through a friend that knew Angelo from years ago. I found OCF through now um, Angelo's brother-in-law Dave. My friend in North Carolina was doing CrossFit, that's how I heard of it. And then my friend and partner in crime, Beth Catlin, found Angelo and she signed us up for the free trial class. I found OCF uh, from a buddy I used to work with and uh, he was a member here uh, and kept bugging me to, to come and, and say he was going to beat me in workouts and do all this crazy stuff so uh, one day I finally took him up on the offer and came here for lunch uh, to do a lunch workout and uh, got destroyed and <laughs> just been here ever since. I've stayed a member at OCF for almost five years now because 
I really found something that is enjoyable. I get really bored very easily, so I need to find something that I can stick with in the long term. And when I was personal training, um, you know, I really thought that I kind of knew what it meant to work out. And when I came here at OCF, I really discovered what it was really like to go through a workout and to be pushed and to be encouraged and challenged. Um, so every single day you come into this place, no matter if you're tired, you're exhausted, um, you've had a long day of work, you always leave feeling amazing and strong and it's really empowering. So in working out here at OCF, I've been pushed to do a lot of things that I wouldn't normally do on my own. It's constantly changing. Um, the workouts are never really the same outside of the you know the benchmark workouts and testing stuff that we do. But uh, every day is different, and every day you think you you got something worked out and nailed down, and then you'll do a different workout and it'll just it'll crush it or or humble you a little bit. That might be a better way to put it. And um, I think that helps me coming back. As far as you know, I, I feel like I'm in good shape, but then I work out, and some of these workouts just definitely make me take a step back, and, and just keeps me motivated, keeps the drive, uh, the competitiveness, the competitiveness there um, to keep coming back after all these years. The reason I stay at OCF is for my mental clarity. I really feel a big difference from when I don't come, from when I do come. I feel just more energy, uh, more positive in all aspects of life. What keeps it coming back to OCF is is actually the coaches. I mean, the coaches are great. Um, the people are amazing. Um, you come in here, you see a lot of the people that uh, um, are a little bit older than you are, a little bit younger, and it's, it's just a great all-around group that uh, you come and hang out with and then work out with, which is great. The workouts are challenging, and they're changing, and they're not boring. I always feel like I'm pushing myself. And then the community that I became a part of became really an essential part of my life. Um, and having those two as a combination became something that was really a part of my life, not just like a thing I was doing in addition to my life. I have stayed a member at OCF for the past four years because I think that this is the best place to get the best workout in a short amount of time. I enjoy the class atmosphere because I feel that I'm motivated to do better and encouraged by other people in class. I think the community, for sure. Um, we've made great friends here, and I really like the group class setting, so I feel inspired and motivated when I'm in a group setting, and especially when I'm with friends. One of the main reasons that I stayed a member at OCF is, is just, I mean, the, you know, it, it, it's the reason that everybody else does. You know, you have a great community and you get results. You know, there's amazing coaches. And I mean, what else can you ask for from the gym?